Hello, Robbie Wong here. We've drafted this red black deck with one white card. That's right. Uh, one white card in Adult Gold Dragon. We're going to support that with the Plains and Evolving Wilds and these four Plundering Barbarians. So, sort of generic red black. And we have some removal Power Would Kill, Raven, Feeble Mint, and Grim Bounty. So, with those four removal spells, only two of them are real. Let's give it a go. <clears throat> we won one game off stream. Yeah. Mensir. Did we draft? One, two, three, five, question mark. One, two, three, four, five. Interesting. Red, white, no plays, one and two. So this is the dwarf dude, right? You know, it'd be great is if they played a piece of equipment. Hey, kiddo. Okay, so let's attack. This doesn't have pack tactics yet, and if they block, we can minus one, minus one it. Yeah, they don't want to do that. Let's hide the planes and play the vampire spawn. This will discourage them from attacking. And we still have power wood kill. What happened? If what? No, what happened to that thing? This thing? No, the other thing. The thing you just played. Oh, the, this one? Yeah. It, when vampire spawn enters the battlefield, each opponent loses two life and you gain two life. No, like oh, what happened? This. Does this have first strike? Wait, they can pump it right? Yeah. Like, what happened to that? That thing's the guy. Oh, there's there. Look, I said this this guy was coming. Oh, All right. nine. Well, this is a dwarf warrior. Um, I think there is some valley. <laughs> In, we can't quite do both. I think, like, if we're gonna kill this anyways, let's go ahead and kill it. And there, there's some discussion in waiting to see if they invest next turn in, like, playing equipment and putting it on there, but uh, I think I'd rather get the point of damage in. Yeah. Yeah, and if they're if they're on empty, that's fantastic for us. Okay, so let's attack, plink him for one, and then clattering skeleton gets to come in. And I think, oh, when it dies, not when it enters. That's great. So they're going to they're going to spend a lot to equip this. Uh, I. Th well, again, if, if they're going to die, let's just go ahead and kill this now. Yeah, and they, sh they should be on empty. We'll swing for five, put them to nine. We'll play Plundering Barbarian and kill the plate armor. There's there's some... Smash the chest, destroy target artifact. There's some discussion in killing this. Oh, wait, no, that's not the haste one. This is the one that needs to die. Yeah, plus three, plus three. This is equipped four as well. Yeah. Shazam! Look at that. We win, Junie. Uh, there is coins thrown out of the way. Yeah, this, the stage has lots of treasures. Mm. Hello? Yeah? Thanks. What was that? That's part of your shirt. Oh. 
Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, the, the jersey, yeah. yeah. Number's falling off. Yeah, I don't think it really matters anymore that you have the number. It's just a shirt. It's supposed to cover your private. All right, so no no black mana, but if we do, this is a pretty good hand. Yeah, and at least you have some mana. Yeah, we have we have three draws to hit it. Look at that. We, we, could, we found our swamp. And look, you can just, you only need that one for reds, right? Mm-hmm. All right, well, now we have Grim Bounty online once we get there. Swamp, Vampire Spot, mm, Swamp. Clattering Skeletons. Aggro start from the opponent. Okay, mm here, and we're trading this very aggressively. Hopefully they don't equip this with the... Uh, yes, that's fine. My mom bought some more. Yay. Oh, I was just saying, and hopefully some, they don't attack with this. And some lemonade, but tomorrow you have to... There's lemonade, but um, it's for tomorrow. Okay. Our tea party. Okay. Ask right. mom what stuff is for the tea party because you might eat stuff like four at a time. Tea party and mom has to go back and pay for all that stuff. This is an instant. That's true. So they'll they'll still get to put this if they want if they play a land. Uh, I can't block with this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and attack. Next turn we can fireball this and hopefully they're out of gas because this is like mono red aggro equipment stuff. Wondering Barbarians is good for when we stabilize. This is an instant? One, two, three, four. Okay, so we can Fireball, or we can Hexblade Plundering Barbarian. We're at three. I think I just want to nuke this and, and be done with it. Well, that's not good. Get in there, vampire. You're a vampire, right? He is a vampire. Ooh, out of gas would be so good for us. Okay, so... Is it worth one life to draw a card? I think it is. Okay, let's go ahead and attack, and then let's develop our board, and I think I'm going to save this Plundering Barbarian for an artifact. There's a target here, but there's a chance that they play that, that golem, that 5-3 golem that has to attack or block. There's not a whole lot of artifact creatures in here, but 3 mana for a... Sleeping. <laughs> well, this is going a lot better than yesterday. Huzzah. Okay. We've got a birthday party to go to tonight. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Fast games. Where I went. Fast games. Where I went. Brave. Yeah. Removal. Play three, sure. We have been playing a <laughs> against a lot of uh, just plundering barbarian for days. Uh, we can also ramp with this. I have to. Hold cow. Like the first one can make a treasure, and then the second one can target equipment. This is mono. Again? This is first strike. That's a problem. Uh, yeesh. I mean, I guess these technically trade. We'll minus one, minus one it. All right. I traded a one mana creature for a three mana creature. We're 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 good with that. And again, this one's going to make a treasure. We have three, three in the bin, three on call. It's a mirror. Man, our, our opponents with no threats. No threats of opponents. Dragon's fire. Okay. 
Deal. What about the second Plundering Barbarian? Okay, we technically have Power Word Kill up. Unless they play like a Red Dragon in two turns. This is such a waste of power wood kill. Power word kill. Yet yeah, here we are. I, I don't think we win by waiting around. I think we, we, we kill what we see and, and, and push our board presence. Clattering skeletons. Our own clattering skeletons. If we fireball this, we get in for four. Let's just play this. slower roll down because this is kind of our last resource and I, I don't know what they're there are some crazy end game pieces here like that holy cow I'm so happy I didn't spend this on a okay so we're gonna have to discard a card that's fine yes not okay I knew the I knew the the third plundering barbarian was good for something. Ooh. Alright, hopefully that's that's the end of that. Okay, we both get to venture. Land is good, spells are good. Um think we're the aggro and I don't think we're gonna be venturing any other time soon so let's uh let's plink each person I mean they don't they've taken the defensive posture we've taken the offensive posture 6-6-A alright where's my humongous thing so this is a little unfortunate we're now two lands behind playing this We can, we can technically double block, and we're trading two cards for one card, but uh, maybe they're out of gas, they attack, and we can try and race them. Nice. Good draw, opponent. Okay, take six. Feign death. Uh... That's not bad with, with this. And we can go treasure, feign death, another treasure guaranteed this 6-5. We only have one red source. That's bad at the draw. Our copy here. Alright, so we're gonna feign death this, make another treasure to guarantee Baleful Beholder. Also the option if they play another artifact to just shatter that. And we can also just let it through and hit for six. I guess, I guess we're still hitting for more than that if, we, if this if this works the way I want it to. Best case scenario is if opponent plays a uh, class swamp class. Okay, we can draw a card, or we can go nuts with this. Ugh. I, th I think they have to block here. Let's see if they, they miscalculate. Yeah, okay, they block. No feign death on their part. And then I think we have to do this. And we'll, we're hoping to trade here. Oh, 
I should have done this and pushed damage. Oops. So they should be at three. They should be at three. Ugh. And if they were at three, they'd be dead. They wouldn't be able to make this play. Big mistake, big mistake. rather than be at three and us have a well i guess we'd, we we would have taken more damage if we had the swarming goblins okay i'm dead to removal but i also think i kind of need to go to one two cards in hand okay You're definitely on the back foot and i think we've died Womp womp. Okay, so I should have read my whole card. Baleful Beholder would have given the Menace, could have pushed more damage. I don't know if it would have impacted the game, but it was definitely better than what I did. Watching LSV, though, he, he said in one of his drafts that he would rather he would rather make a mistake on these low stakes just arena matches because then it doesn't matter and he gets to learn it forever. Which I can appreciate. Ooh, we got good finishers. If we draw one more land, we can we can work our way there. Well. Opponent's thinking really hard about this mulligan choice. That means it wasn't a snap keep, which means I shouldn't uh, mulligan this. We just need a, a, a mountain and, an, and a complimentary evolving wild. There we go. I think we lead with vampire spawn, so we have flexibility here in plundering barbarian. Okay, maybe we lead on Plundering Barbarian then. I mean, we have the spare, so we can use this to... <sighs> We're not really nullifying anything, are we? Okay, green, white, venture into the dungeons. Slash healing. Slash you drew a... <laughs> you opened a good rare. I'm, I'm gonna smash this. I guess there's some discussion in, in having a treasure, so if we draw a land, we can guarantee the adult gold dragon, which is pretty good, but... Hmm. Now... Save this. It's just a three four. Now I want the treasure. Drawing a land means we adult gold dragon, which is preferred. Not drawing a land means we vampire spawn or maybe power would kill. And then these guys are just chilling. Wow. With the read. Cleric class. Life gain. Yeah. Well, we drew the land. So that's something. Vampire spawn just clogged this up. Evolving wilds is good. Land is good. Two lands is, is good too. Running six sixes. Yeah, especially if we can have power would kill. 
power word kill to back up the following attack. And then if they let it through, then we just play the second one. All right, we have a plan. We have a plan. We only have two of these and two, one planes, one evolving wilds. Oh, there's a 5-3. There's a Grim Bounty. That makes a treasure too. I think we kill this one. They didn't attack with these cards, so. Well, Adult Gold Dragon, you move right up there. Grim Bounty, I did not count you as a mana fixing. Sweet, it's a dragon head. <laughs> okay. Opponent's out of gas, and we have 4-3 Flying Haste and uh, all the goodies. Clunk. Uh, yeah. So they're kind of at 20. I, I can't forget that, but... Oh, they, need to, they need to pump this up. Yeah, they did that out of order. You... you if you have these options, wait, what? Uh, they, uh, I think this is the, this is the, whatchamacallit, someone gets lifelink, another creature gets first strike. We traded one creature for another creature. Okay, so five mana is good. That means we can swarming goblins. And this this adult gold dragon is going to keep us ahead. And hopefully the swarming goblins just really jams up the board. Fourteen, we'll take it. Now they don't really have good attacks, even if they can activate these this stuff. Like, sure, you got a 1-1, one, one, but I got a 1-1, one, one, too. So this is a great engine, but we've, uh... What do you return? Runor. They're two away from drawing the card. I, I, would, I would take Runor. It's a They're gonna stack on Plundering Barbarian. This is a choice. I mean, I mean, like, Gargoyle isn't big enough to tangle with Gold Dragon. Okay, that's smart. This, they bought themselves two turns. So, our best bet is a land. So, we can start Earth Cult Elemental and Elementaling. Uh, swarming goblins does not have good attacks currently. Oh, wow, we really. <laughs> I, I'm gonna wait on this and wait on this. Opponent playing well. Okay, that's the last plus one plus one counter on tap, so to speak. This power word kill is going to be amazing when it finally goes off. Uh, sacrifices and enchantment. Okay, so we can make them give up one of these. Paladin class. Uh, okay. So just all of the classes. So they'll get to pick the one. If you're mana stuck on this, like if the tax is going to get you, you want to cast this in response to Paladin class. But I, I, I want to see what they do with their attacks before I commit this. I feel like this is probably big enough, but if they also don't attack, I can just save it. And then here's, I think I'm going to go ahead and use my mana. And like they've invested several turns worth of tokens onto that. So I feel very good about that. Clattering skeletons. Oh, this doesn't die to it now. Oh. 
bummer. Oh, they let it. Oh, it can't block. It can't block until you complete a dungeon. Oh no, it doesn't have flying until you complete a dungeon. Read the card. Read the card. Well, we're just gonna gain life for a while. We're gonna we're gonna sit here and pedal. Yeah, I mean, they have uh, another plus one plus one counter. Ten ten. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Kill your land. Save the four, three. We really need another land here. Oh, I miscounted. Oh, this is about to be bad. Because this, this just goes back to a ten, ten. Gain a life on the counter. Oh, I just threw this game away. Should have put this in there too. Oh, that's so many cards. We get to scry. All right. So this might be a little, little, a little late. God, that was not worth it. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna take a pretty big hit here. And then I think we we cast the Belfold Beholder, make them sack an enchantment, and then this is enough to double block this mountain. Oh man. And gains double strike. And we have we have we have lost control of this game. Yeah, it's just it's just not good enough. It's just not good enough. Yeah, I think if I think if we uh, blocked better, we could have taken the land out. That was a pretty huge mistake, because then them giving something double strike is is still an issue. Because like the the five power is is good, but yeah, we don't have enough time. All right, uh, I'll be back later tonight. Uh, thanks so much for watching. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and I will catch you guys on the send the cast next time. Oh, I didn't have this the chat on.